So conversations, I hate them. All right, that sounded bad. Let me start over. So conversations, forget it. I'm just gonna come in. I don't like conversations. To get a gist for what I'm talking about, I used to date this very extroverted girl. She loved talking to people. It was disgusting. When the relationship started to feel like it was coming to an end, I ended up making this list of reasons why we should stop seeing each other just to sort out my feelings. And it's safe to say that that reason was close to the top. I eventually crossed it out because I thought it would be pretty rude to tell someone you've shared a deep connection with that, yeah, you talk to people too much. It's gross. I would rather not put myself in a situation where awkwardness and anxiety can build. And conversations are like chock full of that sh But don't get me wrong, that doesn't mean I don't like talking to people. In fact, just about a week ago, me and my roommate stayed up till like four in the morning and had a great talk about life and relationships. I was at class the next day, I immediately regretted it. But that was a genuinely good conversation because I know my roommates. We've been cool for years and we developed a high enough empathy and familiarity to the point where we'll get something out of this conversation and it won't be awkward. But with people you don't know, that isn't necessarily the case. See, my first two years of college, I had this Spanish class that was based in participation, which is fine. You have to speak the language to learn it, I guess, whatever. But one part of the participation was doing a group activity. See, I'd be fine to do that, but can we just get rid of the group? Right? Yeah. But I usually still find a way to muddle through all the random conversations and still get full credit. That is usually until we got to Wednesdays when I'd meet with my partner, Dylan. Oh, hey, Kurt. What's up? Hey, Dylan. Uh, Do I'm you cool. know what chapter we're on today? I think the it's- teacher said- I think it's chapter- Wait, no, where? What, it's on, yo, can you please- are you gonna, do, do, Hold on. Wait a second. Why are we partners? I hate you. We would constantly, constantly talk over each other. Like, I'd be in the middle of a sentence and he'd think it was over and he'd just start talking. Like, like no, I'm, I'm not done, guy. Don't interrupt me again. And this would happen- Every freaking day, like every day. It ended up coming to the point where we both silently decided that we'd be better off just like, not talking to each other. And Dylan, if you're watching this, that's not to say you aren't a good guy. Uh, you're actually you're like a really kind, considerate dude but I would rather lose 10 points every day than have to speak to you again. Another thing about conversation I've slowly started to realize is that like with stuff like greetings, specifically, how are you, is that no one, no one like really cares. People don't say, how are you with genuine interest about how your day was? I, I know this because I don't, unless you're like, like a good friend or a person of interest at the time. So by that logic, if you say anything to me outside of good, all right, or not bad, you are officially overstepping our conversational boundaries. This is a transition to get to the next part of this small talk we're having. This is like a bus stop. We don't want to be here all day. In fact, sometimes when I start a conversation with someone I'm not too familiar with, I worry that they're going to hit me with like some deep depressing news that our level of friendship is not ready to conversate about yet. Yo, how you doing, man? Terrible. Because today I learned I failed the test that would determine if I could stay in school. Now I can't even live in the dorms. I have nowhere to go. I'm homeless. My parents refuse to help me. Everything that I've ever worked for is gone, just evaporated into mist, and there's no way out. Well, I'm good. Now I'm going to feel bummed that your life is going to ruin. And I had to speak to you longer than 15 seconds. See, I get concerned that whenever I say a statement that takes longer than 15 seconds, the person listening will immediately disengage. I always get this overwhelming feeling that the other person is probably thinking, so the other day, when will this guy shut class, up? He's man, been talking forever. You know what? I hope he dies. I hope he dies right now so I can get out of this conversation. Stop talking. Just die so you can stop. Even though, like, in reality, he's probably just thinking, Oh, that's pretty interesting. But I'd rather not chance it, to be honest. So all in all, like, I like conversations. I know this whole video makes me seem like an insane narcissistic sociopath, but I assure you that's only like one third correct because I am willing to work through those awkward moments. Mostly if the reason we start the conversation is to talk about me. I I'm just playing, I I'm not really a narcissist, <laughs> probably. What's up, y'all? So if you like that video, uh, if you're new here, might as well subscribe. Welcome to the fam. It'd be really cool. That sound really lame saying that. I'm gonna cut that. I probably won't. If you like that video, uh, drop a like and let me know in the comment section below how y'all feel about conversation. It's a very interesting topic. I don't really got much to say um, other than I'm gonna keep 
we're still going. We're still going. Um, let me throw out the shout out. So shout out to Queen Kitty. Sorry. <laughs> at Ray's Mistress. So thank you a lot for the love you give me. Like I've seen like a lot of engagement from you, and I, I gotta show you some love for that. So thank you. And if you yourself want a chance at getting a shout out at the end of this video, retweet my pin tweet on Twitter if I actually have it up in time. Um, but that's really about it. Uh, thank you guys for sticking around. Uh, more fun stuff to come, and that's about it. Usually, I have more to say at these end cards. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Share the video, especially like that would be, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, all right, y'all. Um, peace.